Hey, and Aiden Hutchinson with Hutchinson out for the rest of the year. And it is a running play by Pacheco as his first record. Illinois were picked off by the Illini. Pacheco ran for two yards of the first play of the game. Now Vedral stands in, throws, looks to the right. To sustain the drive, they'll have to pick up a third and long on third and eight. Good pocket, and Vedral will go deep and two hop. Short circuits a drive that had produced six positive plays for Michigan and had them in Rutgers territory. Shenizian, the fortunate one to scoop it up. Brendan White, the Ohio State transfer, back after mid-21 game Big Ten losing streak with a win in their opener against Michigan State. Since then, three straight losses. Federal had a completion earlier on the drive. He looks for a second, and it's Crookshank. Down the team after the six-yard pass play to Crookshank. As Federal under pressure, and down he goes. The line of scrimmage gets low, gets a sack. Playing with Temple here, Bedwell to throw it on third and 21. SHI Stadium in Piscataway. We're here tonight for Rutgers and Michigan. Mark Fallabell, James Laurinaitis, Elise Miniker on the sideline. Our rules analyst is Dean Blandino, and this is Federal going deep. They're set, not going with Temple. And it's Aaron Young. Young to the edge on a snap inside the 15. Ross. Well, Crookshank on this play, he's going to act like he's going vertical, and then he bends it across the formation. That free safety right there does a nice job. Oh, it's Johnny Langan in at quarterback, and the direct snap to Langan. You have Crookshank out there as well. Do they do a sweep with him? Do they throw with Langan down here low? Langan looked left, runs right, stays on his feet, looking for his third rush. Trying to build on this one now. The energy got a real pick-me-up when they have the fourth and one stop as no eventual throws, and it's caught on the left side by Book. Booker's only win against Michigan was in 2014. A little shovel pass to Langan, who ran the... We go into two minutes left in the first quarter. And Bedwell faked the handoff, rolls right, rolled all the way to the sideline. Tuck Green is the other corner. Brad Hawkins, Dexton Hill, safety. And again, the quick pass off the snap, went to Melton, and Melton is... Tackler, as you said, for the Wolverines. And Rutgers tries to just do a little flip pass to Bo Melton, and he makes... Jamon Green miss. Missed field goal by Nordine a moment ago. Rutgers in front, 7-0. No Vedral with the pass, and it's caught. Goes down, and it does not look good. No Vedral. Missed on his first two passes. He's completed eight in a row, but a lead. From their 40. Adams again. Stood up. Bounces out. Brad Hawkins will force a conversion of the game for the Scarlet Knights, who move it over midfield. Jones in motion. Federal on the play fake. Looking for Melton down the sideline. Earlier in the week, he said, we have to take advantage of how much man Don Brown is going to play at Michigan. We have to give our wide receivers a chance and one-on-one -on -one coverage. If the and that ends that streak of eight straight completions. But he'll try to start another streak. Tempo on offense. Four receivers bunched to the right side. Federal will keep it and is close to a first step. He had a nice game against Michigan State earlier this year, having seven tackles. And now on the move, it's, Cru it's Crookshank giving it to Shami Jones on the reverse. And Jones directing traffic, pass blocks, and that... You, know, you saw this against Ohio State, whether it's reverses, throwbacks, all this stuff. This is a jet sweep into a reverse to Shamin Jones. You never know... And the last time they were down in this territory, Johnny Langan was the Wildcat quarterback. He ran it in then. He's looking to throw it in now, but he's going to be forced to run it. And he now for the one, the snap to Langan and off the right side and into the end. Victory today over. I can't believe I'm saying it. It's never happened before. 0-5 Penn State. Federal, nowhere to go. Holding. Offense. Number five. Ten-yard penalty. First down. Move back ten yards to the 29. Federal off his back foot. You've got a gift with the holding call. You have to recapture some momentum for your team. Motion out of the backfield by Pacheco. Deep ball down the sideline and a 50-50. He's coached. He knows a thing or two about man coverage. They'll dial up that coverage again here on third down, but they won't need it because Federal is running, and Federal's going to run for the first. Third and extra long. Get a chance to get out the field. I wonder if they'll take a shot here. They send Christian Trimble in motion. 
And it's another reverse, but it's bobbled, and Shami Jones successfully run a reverse tonight with Jones running it all the way to the Michigan floor, but a poor exchange here, James. Now it's going to be some out. Just bad execution that time. And a loss of six yards, but they do keep the ball because of Dedrill being Gabe Newberg. Newberg comes up the middle here, just takes a couple steps, take a shot in man coverage. As Rutgers has it, moving into the red zone. Aaron Young. The throw, Federal going in zone. Jones adjusts to the. He's got to come up with it. We saw Federal scramble on third and long in a moment ago. They throw it right back to the same route on the play before that. That time, it's a double move. And a pass that went to St. Russell along the sideline. And now it comes out from Federal. And coming back four yards through the air tonight. That play went for 12. Pacheco. Federal will toss it back to the outside. Pacheco on the run. After that last score, how will they respond? Pivotal response play here on third down and three. And it's Federal rolling and throwing. And we've been informed by Michigan officials that Cameron McGrone will not play for the rest of the game. Mike Linebacker hurt in the first half as Pacheco bounces out. Plays at the largest exchange of real estate in the game. And that was an exchange of real estate and an exchange of points. Seven rushing touchdowns in 2019. To throw Noah Vedral. And he's looking for Bo Melton, and he finds him. And it is big plays of plenty to start the... As he goes up the field, but he stays flat. He does not get enough depth. See how he peeks out there? By that time, Bo Melton splits him. That's an easy read for Noah Vedral. This week about do your job in terms of bouncing back from having a 10-point lead and not being able to bring it home against Illinois. Gain of three on the run by Adams. Quick pass, Aaron Young. And Young, hit it the first down. Don Brown told us this week that his play and practice performance merited some time, and he has his time right now. Hit by Josh Ross, and tempo for Rutgers here on offense. Aaron Crookshank got a block on the edge from Shamin. Now facing a mountain of second down and 19. Vedral rolling, pump fake, avoids Ben Van Summeren at the sideline, throws on the move and throws it up for grabs. And how about that for Rutgers? Grab of the 41 yard line of Michigan. With Rutgers up by three in the third to Crookshank. And Jones is able to. Quick snap, seven minutes gone by third quarter. This time to the right side. Line of scrimmage, Giovanni Haskins, top of the screen. Inside, Aaron Young. Running play. Another running play for Aaron Young. Give him a chance to go make a play. Did he make a play on third down and seven? They're going to give him a chance with two defenders. Absorb the big hit. And now motion by Jones, a little misdirection. And it is Federal. A Cornelius Johnson fumble. Federal fakes the handoff and will heave it to Nebraska. Six games there over the last two seasons. And now the Rutgers starter, and he throws that backwards pass to Shawnee Jones. Some life out of his team and a lead in the game now. Ball comes out quickly for no. It's Michigan State, Indiana, and Wisconsin. Running play, Kayron Adams. Big play. Out of the backfield, Adams. Third and five. And they convert. They pick up the needed first down. And open up the window for Noah Vedral. Now Vedral with Josh Ross coming after him. And the home. Just a blow by for Josh Ross. And a loss of 17 on the sack. Vedral keeps it. 30-yard line, 35. Adam Shibley's played a lot since then. Marker down to the snap. Backwards pass to Bolt Milton. Spun out of a tackle up high. Charlotte Knight's drive. They barely got the snap off in time. And a throw is looped out to the left. In the cover two, finding the soft spot in the zone. Ross had one of the best defensive plays of the game tonight with a 17-yard loss on a sack earlier in the second. Tonight, nine, play, nine rushes, that is, 37 yards. Doesn't sound pretty. 
He's worked hard to pick up what he has picked up tonight as Jones catches, and Jones is up in the same formation to heaven. Now in Michigan territory. Left him the belly for a long time. Tempo to the offense. Pacheco again. And Pacheco, oh, what a stiff arm. Being a three-yard pickup. Leading third and three. Throw by Federal. And it's a good throw. It's caught by Michigan just had a long drive. Rutgers responding with a drive, but they'll need a two-point conversion to Cashley only two yards on the run, and the clock goes under two minutes. Rutgers has all of their timeouts, but Federal is throwing here for the end zone. We'll see how much time is left for Michigan if Rutgers is able to accomplish those two goals out in front of them. Catch again by... Moves it back to the 27. And they're content to let Pacheco have stopped Michigan. Now they'll snap it. And it's Pacheco running. Pacheco bounces it outside. Another. Which one of them will be the target here? It's Melton. And Melton on the slant with the catch. Now the clock starts again. They have all three timeouts. Off target. On the pass is the first order of business. And they have 46 seconds to do it. On second down, nowhere to go. They stick Hookshank for the trips to the left. In motion out of the backfield by Aaron Young. And the pocket starts to collapse. Federal rolls and spins and a desperation heave. Last gasp for Rutgers. Fourth and nine at the Michigan 11. Down eight. Pressure coming. And Federal steps away and throws for the end zone and it's caught. Into the backfield, Aaron Young. To tie the game, quarterback draw, Federal running, hit, driving in. Field goals tonight, 38, 42 yards. And there is your first dose of Isaiah Pacheco. Pacheco, motion out of the backfield, and this could be a negative play. It isn't. Make the nerves a little different. We'll find out what he has in terms of backbone, as he will have his opportunity. Moving to the other end. Jamin Jones in motion. A right side rollout, a throwback to the left, and it's caught by Giovanni Haskins, and Haskins is going to score! Giovanni Haskins is up here, and so is Michael Barrett, and they're in man coverage. So when they roll to the right, you'll notice Michael Barrett on defense, look, he's like, oh, well, he's blocking, I'm going to turn it into a pass rush. Problem is, he sets you up. And by that point, it's too late. It's one of the hardest things to do because mindset. Now the offense needs to do the same thing. The offense needed a touchdown and a two-point conversion to tie earlier. A touchdown and two-point conversion will win the game now as it... Going to throw it. And now it's Aaron Young throwing it. And it's incomplete. Nice job staying disciplined by Green. Pacheco in motion. Third and six. Federal look right. And he slides it. He's played well. They converted a fourth and nine for a touchdown to force overtime. Now to keep the game alive on fourth and nine. Throwing for the end zone into double coverage and intercept. 